Hey y'all, so today is Smoothie Day 5. And y'all, I was just thinking like, y'all been keeping me accountable. Because I know like, okay, I gotta do a video. Which means I gotta do a smoothie. So, today's smoothie, I knew I was missing something. I'm like, I'm missing something. Y'all, I'm missing a frozen fruit. Duh. Dang, I will be missing the most important ingredient. Alright, I'll be back. Alright y'all, I am back. So, I got the frozen fruit, which this is getting low, y'all. And another thing, I forgot, um, I took, I, um, I ate the last banana yesterday. So, and I do have a bunch of frozen bananas in the freezer, but I'm like, they've been sitting in there for months. So, I'm actually going to toss them out. I think I already talked about this on the last video. I'm going to put them in the, um, my garden area. Or, I don't know, did I talk about that? Um, I'm going to put them in my, I plan on putting them in my, my raised bed garden, just burying it in there and letting the bugs eat it and turn it into compost. Okay, y'all. So today's smoothie is the same as yesterday. The only difference is instead of the banana, I have, um, some just grape juice. And I, I, I said I was going to use this before I even realized I didn't have the banana. So... And then today, after I do this, I'm going to show y'all some other stuff that I have. Um, so, first of all, how are y'all doing today? How was y'all's day? Because, ooh, that opened easily. I didn't know how, how um, hard that was going to be. I had to be careful, y'all. These things would be expensive. I got this from Walmart. I love getting those juices where you can just add whatever you want to it or add it to whatever you want no sweeteners no nothing so, so yeah how was y'all how was y'all's day let me know in the comments today for me i really didn't even do anything my first day off work and you know it's just one of those days it's so crazy i was just watching um zaddy chunk chunk's video and the title of the video was, it's just one of those days. And I'm like, same, like literally how I feel. Yeah, so I just need to clean my freezer out because I got some, I have frozen, um, I don't know. I'm going to have to check it because I have some frozen strawberries in there. But I think I had those strawberries <laughs> from the, the house that I was in, when I lived in the house before I moved here, so... I was just looking looking in there. You know how you don't want to get rid of something because it's like new or, you know, it's just, it's a whole thing. Like it's a big old thing it is. Like never, I don't know if it's never, I don't think it's ever been open. So it's just one of those things like I don't want to get rid of it, but then I'm scared to use it. So it's time for me to get rid of it. I really want to get a deep freezer, y'all. Um, But y'all know I just bought my car. So that comes with a lot of expenses. And... It's time for me to, I plan on tomorrow getting my, um, registering and, and everything, you know, whatever I got to do. Oh! Because my 30-day tags expire tomorrow. So. Yeah, because I don't have my, um, I don't have the banana. So, I'm going to put a little extra of that. So, today, the difference and quality is I have an uh I put one of my LED shop lights. Um I just literally installed it right before this video. It's a strips um shop light. I put it uh, right above me here and I think it's really helping out with the lighting because the lighting in this place is so horrible. Like I switched over to um I switched all my bulbs over to <laughs> as I'm saying this, I'm just thinking about how that maintenance man was like, maybe I <laughs> I'll get you a new bulb. I'm like, I don't want... Because he was like, maybe it's either a new bulb that you need or um, the light switch. Which, the light switch, is, it worked pretty good today. So, But I was like, I was just thinking like, girl, I don't want y'all... I don't want y'all light bulbs. Y'all little, war, little warm light bulbs. I switched everything over to like a high, a high LED, a high wattage or whatever LED light. Except for like my little, um, my lamps. I keep that at warm, but y'all, the lighting in here is so bad. 
Okay, so, oh yeah, for people that don't know, the mix that I use is Cherry Berry Blend. It's Strawberry Blueberries Pitted Dark Sweet Cherries and Pitted Red Tart Cherries. Um, so, so, that's just the blend that I have right now. You know, they all have their different benefits. And then, the um, Power Greens Mix. My Kalanik lady told me about these. It's um, spinach, chard, and kale. So she said focus on the greens. That, but not having a banana, it really is throwing me off. Oh yeah, I can, I'm starting to smell these greens, so that means I gotta really pack them in because I still have one more container. Hopefully when I go back to the store again, because I got these from Myers, I'm hoping they have these on um, sale again on some on clearance you know I always try to get stuff that's on clearance because um and just get enough for you know what I can use before it goes back you know <sighs> y'all so today is my off day this this one again amazing grass clean greens detox and digest y'all and I okay so I started my Amazon affiliate program back up yesterday, but then I tried to link like stuff from the video for y'all because I got this from Amazon, um, the Ninja from, from Amazon, you know, it's a lot of stuff either I got from Amazon or I can link it on Amazon. So at least people can know the product that I'm talking about. And then if they want to get it, they can get it. And then, um, I'll get a small percentage, which I actually, I noticed I'm like, using it and then I'm setting it to the side okay I actually got my little trash bag today too so this is going to be a quick one y'all I think because I'm like getting used to the groove like getting in the groove chia seeds I got these from Walmart they're ground chia seeds and you know that the chia they give you those omega 3's and um, it says it's free of cholesterol, high protein, high fiber, high iron. Oh, thank God. Uh -uh. Y'all, I need it. I was just saying how I've been feeling tired and I need my iron. And I know the greens give you it too. But I need my iron, my B12, my vitamin D. And um, what else was I saying? Vitamin D. Vitamin D, B12 iron i think that was the main things because that's the things that i usually lack and i have the hemp seeds y'all supports cardiovascular health omega-3 and y'all know it has protein i believe it's a whole a whole protein or whatever when i used to be vegan i used to care about that type of stuff and i just eyeball it y'all i love these so much like I'm like I always want to buy it like this or you know buy it in bulk and put it in these containers but make sure I empty it all the way <laughs> empty the container all the way out before I put more in here because you do not want no expired seeds and nuts that oil that rancid oil honey trust me I tell y'all every video because it will mess your whole smoothie up your whole life <laughs> It will mess your day up. So, supports cardiovascular health, omega-3s. It says ala omega-3s. Um, do flaxseed have protein in it? Yeah. Three grams of protein. It has calcium and it has iron in there as well. Okay, y'all. This is a protein smoothie. Because it's protein in all these. Plus, it's protein in the yogurt, and it's probably some protein in the greens too. Let me see how much you're supposed to put. Two tablespoons. Okay, I'm probably doing like, I feel like I probably only doing like one tablespoon at the most. But of course, I'm using all three, so. All right, I feel like I'm getting quicker and quicker with these, y'all. What y'all think? I'm almost done. 
But yeah, I'm off today, y'all. When I tell you, I did not even look at that time at that clock until um what time was it? I did not look at that clock until it was 4 p.m. My alarm went off this morning, or I stopped it. I don't know, one or the other. Ooh. Yes. Ooh, y'all. I put this thing up, didn't I? But that's the last ingredient I needed to put in here. Um. Yeah, one of my friends reached out to me yesterday and was talking about, you know, just, you know, because I've just been talking to God, like, I don't know. I feel so, I'm scared of people, y'all. I was in this horrible, scary ministry from hell. And it was like every person in there were was a wolf in sheep clothing. Like, not every person in there. Every person that came to me. They all came to me like, oh, I want you to help me with something, woman of God. Hey, sis. Like, all of them. And then they all went crazy. Like, soon after, y'all. It scared. It scared them. <laughs> mess out of me so it's like man i just i like i immediately ran from that ministry to the top ministry um and it's a healing and deliverance ministry well it's a prophetic deliverance ministry so i literally i ran from there to the top um oh my gosh are you not wanting to open again i mean closed Ugh. i was about to shake it i'm glad did i shake i hope i shook it before i did this y'all because this don't want to close so you know you do not need uh oh they say it's only four servings per container eight fluid ounces really i wonder what this tastes like by itself i ain't gonna put my mouth on it because well i guess it's just me huh all right y'all this ain't really so yeah i ran from that ministry to the the top Healing and Deliverance Ministry that I know of, y'all. When I tell you, I spent thousands of dollars in therapy with them. From everything I experienced at that crazy ministry, I'm like, I'm scared. I'm scared of people. So I'm, I'm really scared to, you know, and when I surrender my life to God, I let go of everything and every person in my life. And, I, you know, I told God, like, whatever you want, whoever you want to bring back, whatever, you know. And so I've been having a couple friends. It's only one person from my past that God has allowed me to, you know, have in my life. And man, this person has been such a blessing. That plus, you know, I mean, there, there, there is other people, but they just haven't, um, you know, I just haven't come across them or whatever. But other people that try to come back, you know. Guys, like, no. Nope. All right, y'all. Always try to show y'all. So, yeah. So, I had my friend, this friend. I've been praying, like, you know, about this friendship. And, like, I, I don't know. You know, I'm scared. Is this going to be another crazy, you know? Is it? Is this what the world is? Just full of crazy people? All right, y'all. Close your ears. One, two, three. the same color as yesterday's too i'm kind of scared of how it's gonna taste y'all because i don't have that banana but um i feel like everything just adds another layer you know like the the fruit adds a layer and then when you put the the um the yogurt in it adds another layer and then the the greens that add excuse me another layer and then the different seeds that add other layers and then the, the green powder like you can't taste the green powder at least i haven't been able to taste it lately but it just all has all these different layers. I'm going to do a blend. Of, I want to blend it more, you know. I just let it do it on its own. All right, y'all. This is my first time having... Let me get this off here. This is the one thing I don't want to fall I ain't trying to deal with that mess, and that's great. This is good that I'm taking this down because I actually want to use this table. Let me show you. Ooh. I should 
should have brought me now nah, i'm like i could have brought something to wipe this table down with but moment of truth y'all this is my first time having grape juice see sometimes it be the greens be stuck to the blade and then when it does that it doesn't blend you see it's like a whole chunk it's been doing that lately so i got my bag here i'm a little more prepared today you know what i realized this is kind of like doing a mukbang it's like a smoothie mukbang because i'm here i'm um i'm making a meal i mean a drink i'm making something you can consume and then i'm eating it i mean i'm drinking it well it's food it's food that i'm consuming okay yeah that be looking so i don't like the way that be looking y'all all right y'all cheers Too. This kind of tastes like grape juice a little bit. Wow, that's interesting. Okay. I missed my banana. Y'all, I'm getting to fall over myself. Okay, so the banana... It really gives it that, like a creaminess that I don't, I don't get right now. Mm. This is so interesting, y'all. It makes me happy, though. And you know what I'm thinking, though? I could have put this back in because I think because those blades were all caught up with that stuff wrapped around them it didn't blend it good enough so mm, it's okay I like my smoothies chewy too but it's definitely a more watery watery one um okay It's good. Right now, I'm tasting the um, the hemp seeds. It's like that nutty. Okay, y'all. But yeah, y'all, this is what came off that blender. Off the blade. So it was like, you know, it didn't blend. Some type of greens. It's like fiber from a green or something. It's weird. It's not... It's like stringy, stringy, you know, fibers that get stuck in the um, the blender. I never seen that before, so it's either the it. I guess it's the char. I don't know, cause I've 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 used spinach before and I've used kale. Let me show y'all. I see I could have pushed the camera back just a little more. So, but I'm going to just show y'all what I bought from Walmart. Oh, this is vanilla bean. I'm just now seeing that. This is what I'm going to be trying soon. The Bulletproof Energy Collagen Protein Caffeine Free Fuel. But, you know, I would add it to, you know, the morning smoothies. It has 20 grams of collagen um, protein. Yeah, it's, it's vanilla bean. And it has ginseng, magnesium, cordyceps, mushrooms, and MCT oil. And um, so it was originally... $26.98 and I got it for $16. Y'all know I love a deal. Y'all, I don't know if y'all can tell, but my energy just feel like it just went down for some reason. I don't know why. And then I have the Vital Performance. And these are things I was looking at online. So when I see, oh my gosh, this has watermelon blueberry. Yesterday I was looking for the flavors and I couldn't find any. 
So this one's watermelon, watermelon blueberry, y'all. Y'all, I could have. I'm like, should I put it in? Should I do it today? This one has amino, aminos, hydration, elect, electrolytes, 20 grams of collagen, eight, eight grams of EAA, five grams of BCAAs. Recover. So I could go to the gym tonight. I haven't literally the only oh yeah I got my taco in there. I was like I went to Taco Bell, <laughs> but the only thing um I went I did today y'all was I was relaxing that bed. I put my feet up on the wall. That's one thing I do. I'll put my feet up on my wall with my bed, my my body on my back. Um, I said I don't have no pillow on my head or not under my head or anything. I do that. I put my feet up y'all to help my circulation. It's really good to elevate your feet. You know, if you have circulation issues or you're, you're a big person, you know, you got a lot of weight on your body, do that, you know, and, and tell me how that helps, if that helps you. Compression socks is also good. I guess I'm just giving y'all some advice <laughs> right now. It helps your circulation, y'all. You know, it helps with back problems and, and all that. I actually have an inversion table. It's the same one that my doctor, my chiropractor has. Well, it's very similar. Um, and so, now that I'm no longer going to the chiropractor, I have to take it out of the box. I literally... I bought it and I was like, I'm not going to go to the chiropractor, y'all. And then I just started going to him. And I, I saw I haven't needed my inversion table. But now that I'm no longer going to him, sad face, I want to start using my inversion table. But I, I'm telling y'all, I feel like I talked about him in every video. But I've, y'all, chiropractic care has changed my life. Um, and like I said, I feel like it helps with weight loss and, and everything. It, I can't say enough about it, okay? I'm going to start my massages soon. But, anyways. This is something I probably could have did today, y'all. It has other things in here, too. Let me just... I'm just going to show y'all, and I'm going to show y'all the next thing. Okay. It's so peaceful. I just love peace. But I do think I want to start adding um, some music in the background. So this I bought from uh, Myers. I just, you know what? I saw this and I was like, I'm gonna put this in the video to, to remind y'all to take your vitamins, especially because we're in the winter time now. You know, it's like cold and flu season. You know, it's just that that time of the year we're not getting our vitamin D like we're supposed to. You know, from the sun and everything. So it's we we probably really need to supplement. And I was just thinking like, you know, it's crazy because the leafy greens grow this time of the year grow best this time of the year right like in the warmer warmer months they they both they go to sea but right now is the perfect time for them to grow and i'm like that makes sense it's like <laughs> i don't know i've been thinking about like eating with the seasons and stuff like that i'm like i think we really need more leafy greens at this time of the year i was i was literally thinking this before like i started the video so yeah i got me one a day for her um Vita cravens teen gummies just so I can have some gummy vitamins. I like to have different things, different options like gummies, capsules, um, capsules, you know, pills, all the, all the different things. And then, okay, y'all, so I want to show y'all my package. I literally just got my um, knife and opened it up. Not knife. And speaking of vitamin D, I ordered this from Amazon. It's the vitamin D with the K2, which you need K2 um, to, for your body to absorb the vitamin D, to, to tell the vitamin D where to go. So the vitamin D doesn't like calcify different organs or whatever, blood streams, and it actually goes to where it needs to go. I don't know, y'all. I used to know this stuff. So, but look it up, though, okay? <laughs> look it up. But, yeah, so... One thing I'm, I want to start doing is taking this with y'all. Because this, y'all helping me, y'all helping me to remember. So these are the um, replacement cups to my Ninja. I hope, I, I, um, I put the right model number on here, so I'm hoping it works. It's two cups, so I'm about to see what it look like. And I really want to put the link on there. But YouTube was not allowing me. Yes, I hope this works because it has the measuring the measures. Oh, this looks better than mine. Let me see. What I do it? I'm about to try it right now. 
Oh, it feels cheaper though. Yeah, see. Oh, it look like it were. Yes. Oh, that just the way it just slid off here. Did y'all see that? That was fun. Okay, it's twenty four ounces. Yes, I gotta watch it anyways. Yes, y'all. This is what I wanted. So I can just kind of like be like, okay, around eight ounces it is. Around, you know. Okay. Yay, yay, yay. These are about to get washed. And then I got another one. So I don't have no excuses, girl. Because sometimes I'll already, I'll still have a smoothie in my other cups. Like I have a smoothie here. Maybe some lemonade here. Oh, because I'll do, um some uh, mixed berry lemonades and I'd be like oh I can't do another smoothie because I don't have any available cups and I don't want to drink that smoothie so this is taking the excuses away so, okay y'all I did everything now all, all there's left for me to do is actually take take it right I'm gonna take this so what it's dirty why they give you this big old bottle, y'all? When I tell you, girl, where they at? They know they should be ashamed of themselves. How many are you supposed to take? This product is designed for those with higher vitamin D needs. You take one. Okay. So one of them will give you what? 5,000 IUs of vitamin D and 1,000 MCG of vitamin K2. So that's good. This isn't the best vitamin D, and I, I honestly want to get the liquid vitamin D and just add it to my smoothies, you know? Or just take it. It's like, why do it, Why is it so hard to take vitamins? Like, just to, re, just to take your vitamins. Like, I don't understand. They be right there, too. I'm going to take it. y'all give me a verse that I should have put on this video because hmm I don't know I'm thinking of something with health but I feel like I always say something with health but I don't know y'all let me know y'all as y'all can tell I'm like hmm which is um one of the things I was just saying y'all I was, I was about to get off, but I wanted to say that I noticed, like, you know how you start something, you have energy, and then you don't have, no longer have the energy, so I felt like I was doing really good with energy, but now I was like, mm. so I'm like, okay, that means I need to increase even more. I need to get even more healthier things in, and I need to take even more unhealthy things out, so I've only been eating one unhealthy thing a day, I think. Maybe I'm wrong on that, but I'm working on it, y'all, um man this is just really this journey is really helping me though i'm really seeing like dang girl you've been you've been off your game like you used to only eat one unhealthy thing a week <laughs> you know what i'm saying and i was like girl you don't even care so it's like dang i just lost the consciousness of what i was eating like i used to be so health conscious i used to have me a, a, a diary and everything a food diary and so i'm thinking about getting another food diary or just you putting them in my, in my phone what I eat to make sure that I'm being conscious because just I've been unconscious realized I've been unconsciously just eating things like and not even paying attention like hold on this is not good for me you know so I know I keep looking over there I gotta get used to that y'all I literally be staring at, at nothing like if you could see me like I, I usually don't even look at people a lot of the times I just when I talk I just be looking like Sometimes I'll be looking like this. You'll be over here. And I'm like, yeah, because, yeah. They be like, if people be looking like, what you looking at? And I'm like, I don't know why I do that. It's like a baby. You know, you, you be looking at the baby like, oh, they looking at an angel or something. Like, no, they just looking. <laughs> they just looking. Anyways, y'all, I love y'all, but God loves you more. 
stay blessed y'all stay prayed up pray for wisdom and discernment y'all we gotta be vigilant out here y'all that's the word for today y'all that's gonna be the word it's something like remember i am sending you out as sheep as sheep among wolves or something like that all right y'all y'all know what i'm talking about i'm gonna put it on here though it's gonna be in the beginning and the end so y'all already saw it remember i am sending you out Whew. my story is coming out soon in jesus name it's coming out it's coming out love y'all stay safe y'all stay safe y'all stay close to god don't let nothing tear you away from god don't let nothing 